Yo, 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 what's up? Momo from the Momo Zone. We are here at the Corona Day 2. And uh, I'm sitting here with the boys. Yo, say hello to the camera. Oh, what's up? Yeah. What's up, camera? <laughs> I'm here with Simon DT on the project, and uh, it's the day two. So, dude, what's happening, man? How was your day? <laughs> amazing, amazing. Good, good, good. So, uh, as you guys can see, we got some projections happening on the back here. The firewall is starting to happen here, um, and the stage is slowly coming together. So, how do you think this day is gonna? Well, it's pretty good. The band arrived today, so uh, it's a good thing. We're gonna hear some music. The only problem is, the, again, the water wall. Yeah. But uh, it's gonna be fixed. We have a bit of a problem with the water wall because what's happening is we put it a little higher than we anticipated. On peut voir le plan. We're getting a bunch of mist and bounce back when it comes to um, when it comes to the water. Some oversplash. Exactly. Oh, well, that's what we'll call it. So right now they're sticking some a kind of different sponge system in there to try and absorb it more and control it. But otherwise, the thing looks killer on that note till we get back we're leaving you with the firewall and this killer thing Simon in the house the Momo zone the digital kit on the other end of the camera rock and roll we are sitting here with master controller of the light show yesterday you set up all your lights yeah you got to you got to do a little bit of explain to me what you did I did a little of uh, actually yesterday was more of uh, setting up the lights putting everything together and making everything work and today, tonight will be uh, all the programming, uh, cue to cue from one song to the other. So it's a long night for me coming up. <laughs> <laughs> this should mess some heads up because we are doing stuff that's going over the line. Dude, dude, get in here. Get in here, man. Man, Richard, baby, what's up? Hey. We got Projection Boy over here. What's up, yeah. Projection Boy? What's going on? Oh, we're up, SD. We're up and running. And everything is cool. And the cool thing about this, guys, is we're going to mix this inferno that's on the wall with real fire that's going to be coming from the front, right? So it's going to be a kind of a 3D-ish kind of effect. We're going to go BAM! And we're going to fry some people and I'm going to fry a Polish sausage in there uh, tomorrow for you guys. So <laughs> this should be pretty interesting. And the marshmallow. And uh, we'll see what happens. So we'll be getting back to you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Excellent. Peace out. <laughs> What's up, man? Feel the strength of that slap. This is but, Eric, our yeah. focus board. What's up? Eric, Momo? man, you're gonna be pulling some focus today. I'll All make right. sure everything is sharp. What's explain to the people who don't understand what the hell a focus puller means? Uh, uh, explain to them what your mm, what your gig is. Right. Basically, puller. you have an object into space, and the camera is another object into space. Now, objects move into space. So like if you take a picture, you have to take, put it on focus so the image is sharp, but nothing is moving. In movies, everything is moving, so you have to adjust the focus. Mm -hmm. And that's my main job. And you do this in real time, right? Real time, live. That's mathematics, dude. In other words, this guy's flying stuff. blind, man. It's what it's like, right? <laughs> you know it's experience that makes this shit happen. Hey, what did you have in mind? Hey, how's it going, Momo? Everything's good, Thanks. nice to yeah, see you, yeah. Likewise, yeah. Okay, guys, there's a whole bunch of shit happening on stage there. We're gonna go decide about what's happening with the acoustic grand piano, because it just came in, and we gotta check some shit out. So, let's go. Okay, the problem is this, is that this piano is gonna have to be wheeled out this way, okay? So, what if this piano was like this, and was over here, and I left this section open? Is that good for you? It's okay? Okay. Actually, it's... Je m'excuse, t'es correct, mon homme? Non, non, ça va très bien, c'est... Je vais vous donner un petit peu de temps. Yeah. C'est parce que c'est un fucking piano. Yeah, Where should I... Uh, where should I stand? Here? We need like a quarter in here to tighten this uh, thing here. It's just sort of falling down all the time. And, you know, it's going to be a pain in the ass. You said you wanted them to come down. Yeah, I want them to come down. We've got to stick them kind of near the piano. So I figured if we put them in this vicinity in front of this guy... Yeah. At least we'll have a, a kind of a core thing happening, right? Okay. Check out this piano. Let me show you something. This is a kind of an empty shell for a grand piano. Let's go over here. So what happens is you drop the piano on the inside of there and it just looks wicked. We can probably move this in a different way, but the strings, which are up there, you see we've got a second level, okay? For the... This is not going to be open. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. So the strings, okay. Yeah, it sounds and better open. 
So originally we were gonna take them. Are you insistent of the strings being beside you or? Not necessarily, but I think it would. It, it, There's so much to do that I just want to make sure, because this is a rehearsable thing, eh? It's not like we're gonna be popping off people right. and moving them and then moving them back. I think we need to have the strings in different places. I, I'm, I'm thinking we need to have Okay, look, that's the first song where we're doing the real strings. They're moved. Yeah. They're there for the three songs. I, I, I know, but I was planning on having this green go on and then use that as a kind of thing to move it but you're going to be talking and people are going to be moving shit around you without the screen. that doesn't bother you yeah i can work it in we will have to do a test about moving the volume okay but i'll tell you because they're plugged in the only problem is they're plugged in it's kind of changes my plan for my transition but let him talk and then okay. he'll come back and then pat the water wall will come on and we'll just do it like that you know <laughs> you need to know anything else or no okay I, so what's a quick question the piano Dog, what's up, man? Ladies and gentlemen, Ricky D in the house. Yeah, baby. What's yeah. up? You know this, man. You've heard no. the voice. You know how it goes. You know how we do it. Doing it big. I put the head to bed, baby. 100% bonafide. Solid to the rock. Dude, I'm so appreciative that you come and now uh, you are actually being friendly in front of the yeah, camera. It's taken that. me a couple of years to I shove know. the camera in your face, but you've accepted it. You know. You're going with it. I understand my role <laughs> better these days. You know what I mean? That's good, man. My jib that was supposed to be there. Maybe probably put it on stage, shorter one, but uh, to work around the things. Is that is that going to be good for you? Oh yeah, it's better than than there with with those thrusts. Okay. But I have another one at the balcony. On the balcony. Okay, so you have two. Yeah. Oh, two per, as long as you have one that's whipping course, around on the balcony. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. So here I'll be able to move around. It's going to be a good show. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Good show. <laughs> oh, yeah I see. Oh, he's it on. Hi guys. <laughs> I see. Can you say stupid shit? Because that's what's happening here. This shit is stupid. Look at that lightning. This is like off the fucking cuff. I am completely fucking blown. I gotta be telling you. Okay, I gotta go on stage and just talk to Slim a second. <laughs> 